ladies and gentlemen welcome back to makeup by loka miko so today i have again with me a, a product review for you guys of a brand that i absolutely love it's extremely economical and at the same time it has very very high quality products and products that last for a very very long time so much so that uh, their lip creams i have used on my brides as well and lasts for a really really long time so if you're looking out for something which is um uh very very inexpensive and also is very very long lasting then this is the brand for you i will be reviewing their lip products and their eye shadows today so the first product that i have is an eye shadow and this is what the eye shadow looks like uh this is the 0215 i have used this if uh, you guys uh, some of you guys have been watching me right from the start i have used this as a transition shade within my crease quite a bit and this is a very very beautiful uh, sort of a brown shade i have also at times used it to contour my cheeks and my nose so i absolutely love this shade it is very very multi purpose and it's a product that you would absolutely love if it's one eye shadow that you want to have in your uh, makeup kit then this would be an apt eye shadow for you now the next eye shadow that i have is a, uh, this is what it looks like It's a very nice pearly one. It's zero two one three by Miss Claire, and uh, uh, it's a really, really pretty, very shimmery eyeshadow. You can use it on to highlight the bridge of your nose out here, and you can also use it on uh, in in your inner tear duct, which is right here, and also on your brow bone. If you wish to see my makeup tutorials and uh, you want to see how I highlight these exact portions of my face that I just spoke about, I will be linking those tutorials down. below so uh, yeah that's that next shade is a very beautiful sort of a midnight blue color this one is 0434 that's what it looks like and it's again a shimmery shade it's absolutely beautiful uh, the pigmentation is extremely strong as you can see and uh, uh, it comes on very very beautifully onto the lid as well So that's a blue eye shadow that they have. Now the other ones uh, are a little similar, but they are in a matte um, sort of a shade and uh, a, a matte texture and a shimmery texture. So the first one is a matte texture, zero five zero eight. So I had gone through this massive phase for a very long time and wanted to get my hands on a burgundy eye shadow. And when I saw this, I just quickly snatched it and I got it home. It swatches beautifully as you can see and it looks very very beautiful on the lids for someone with a bit of an acquired taste when it comes to eye shadows. So that's a matte burgundy shade and I also have the same one in a little bit of a shiny sort of a corally um, color. and that is the 0506 it's very shimmery it's very pretty and looks very nice on the lids as well so that's that and the next uh, eye shadow that i wanted to talk about is uh, uh, a very sort of a matte eye shadow and uh, uh, this is the 0654 and it's a really pretty orange color so again this is for someone with a very sort of acquired taste in eye shadows and someone who would like to experiment a little bit so this is a very pretty matte orange shade that you can use now the next one uh, and i think the last one that i have as far as eye shadows of miss claire on concern this is a very very pretty pink shade this is 0146 you can You can use it exactly like the white shade that I had showed, and it's really pretty and pink. You can highlight your brow bone. You can use it in the inner corners of your eyes, actually, more uh, uh, towards your brow bone and the inner corners of your eyes. You may not be able to use it on the bridge of your nose, but you can definitely use it as a cheek highlight as well. So this is a very, very beautiful shade. You can also use it as a blush. So that's as far as my Miss Claire eyeshadow section. So now for the interesting part. and that would be its lip creams 
So the first shade that I have that I absolutely <clears throat> love is the 17A. Now that's what the shade looks like and that is how it swatches and it's a very perfect sort of uh, pinky nude shade if you'd like to go in for. Again, all of their lip creams last for a very very long time. So that's something that is very nude. Next is this brown shade and it's in the shade 17. It's a very nice chocolate brown for those of you ladies out there who wish to have like a chocolate brown colour. Then this is a perfect lip cream that you can go in for. The now next shades that I have are uh, more towards the pink side. This is a very nice corally shade called 16A. 16A is something, uh, is for a lady who prefers her corals quite a bit. And the next one is a slightly deeper pink. This again is a little bit bright, not too bright, but a little bit bright. This is in the shade 12. That's how it's watered. And it's an absolutely brilliant shade again. Something that a girl who loves her pinks very much would adapt this actually would really like this shade so that's as far as the pinks are concerned now next moving on to uh, an orange color that i have now this is for someone who again has very acquired taste when it comes to lipstick and is very in for experimenting so this is absolutely Absolutely beautiful that's how it swatches the shade is 16a and it looks absolutely stunning when put on the lips even though it's an acquired shade it's a very statement sort of a color so for you guys out there who are into statement colored lips this is the perfect shade for you now the next are my favorites from the entire lip cream range and those would be their reds one of which I'm wearing at the moment it's absolutely beautiful and this is what it looks like and that, that is how it swatches. It's in the shade 10. It's absolutely stunning. This is a shade that I've used on one of my brides and they have absolutely loved this product. Now the next one is a nice corally sort of a red and it's for the ladies who love their bright red lips. So this is in the shade 01 and it's absolutely stunning and uh, like I said it's for someone who prefers their reds quite a bit, their bright red so it's a beautiful beautiful bright red. I really really hope you liked this video and it was informative for you and it informed you a little bit more about Miss Claire eyeshadows and lip creams and uh, um, I really hope you like these uh, product reviews. Do come in for more, do rate, comment and subscribe, it would mean so much to me. I will see you next time.